Hi guys, I just finished class here in Melbourne Uni. I'm gonna head home now. Let's go! I'll show you where I live. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't know I wasn't supposed to look at the camera. <laughs> so I've been staying here for about five months. I first found it on Tenant F. When I first saw it, I thought it was a scam because it was really affordable compared to other places in the city. And the location is also really convenient because my uni is just right here. And it's just three minutes walk away from me to just go home, you know. I'll show you around. So this is our main reception. It's where you can come from general inquiries or anything. The staff here are really friendly and kind. Let's say hi to Chris. Hey, how are you? Hi, Chris. Do you have mail for me? Yeah, let me see. Looks like we do. Ooh. Nope, not this one. <laughs> Wrong one. <laughs> what was it? You forgot my room number? Yes, I do know your room number. Thank you. What are you up to today? Um, I'm just showing my friends around um, room and curse. Hey, <laughs> hey guys. If you are looking for a shipping accommodation, look for room and <laughs> Look for me. Email at Swanston at romancost.com, all right? Chris is really friendly and oh, funny. <laughs> so this is the Foodie Fox. It's just like Uber Eats, but the only difference is um, the delivery guy will put their food in the locker and you can just come down and get it whenever you want and the food will still be warm, which is really great. So this is our great lounge. Usually it's really packed with students, but I think most students are still in um, uni today. I like to bring my friends around here and we just play table tennis here, um, pool here and just we just really like to hang out around here. So that was the common area and we also have another common area here which I like to come here with my friends during exam times. Um, yeah, we stay up here all night during our exam times and study together here. Um, it's just, there's some more books over Ooh. there. Freddy, yeah. what are you doing here? Well, I'm just doing some routine inspections. Guys, so this is Freddy. He's our community manager. So what's going on today? Um, I'm just showing my friends around Rooming Coast, where I live. So this is our um, movie lounge and there's a TV over there. And as you can see, there's students studying over here. Let's stay quiet. And yeah, and this is like our barbecue lounge. Sausage party. Freddy, what's that? No, it's just something we're doing for all the tenants. So it's a barbecue sausage party. Uh, you can see that we do have a great barbecue area outside. Ooh. So yeah, we're definitely looking forward to it. Let us know if you're coming, RSVP. Hell yeah, as always. <laughs> During exam times, when this exam stress hits really bad, you just step out and you get this fresh air, relieve all your worries. Finally, let's go to my room. So all of this was on the ground floor and all our um, accommodations in the rooms are just upstairs. Let's go. Ah, <sighs> my home sweet home. Eee. So this is my bed over here. I like to study over there my little cupboards where I put all my little itsy bitsy stuff then my fridge here where I put all my personal food so that um that I don't want other people to touch and this is where I um, brush my teeth in the morning wash my face then the wardrobe is just behind you it's really convenient the bathroom and the kitchen are just um common shared room over there which I don't really mind because um, I feel like that's where we communicate, we connect with our housemates, we cook together and we socialize, which I really enjoy it. There's a heater over here as well. As you know, Melbourne's winter can get really cold sometimes. So this is really convenient. So this is our communal kitchen. Um, as you can see, we've got plenty of fridges. We only share like a, um, maybe four to five rooms per fridge. So it's pretty spacious for each of us. And um, we cook over there. We've got oven as well, stove as well. We've got toasters, kettle. Then we do our little dishes over here. Microwave here as well. Um, fire extinguisher. <laughs> 
So we've got this um, cabinet over there as well where we can store our condiments like soy sauce, then plates, spoons, forks, and you can lock it over there as well. And we've got a um, dining room over there, which I like to hang around with my friends after cooking together. So this is where our bathrooms are located, the men's and the ladies. We've got um, showers, toilets, and they're clean every day, even the weekends. Um, so what I personally like to do is um, have like a basket where I put all my toiletries and every time I go to the bathroom, I just bring it. Our bathrooms are not really crowded because we do have um, our kitchen bathroom on every level. I, I really don't have a problem with it and I think it's pretty cool. Another one of my favorite things about living here is you can go to Lagan Street in a snap of a finger. Here we are at my favorite coffee shop on Lagan Street. I want hot chocolate please. I really like the location. <laughs> the tram stop is right in front of Ruminco, so um, wherever you want to go, it's just three tram stops away from Melbourne Central Station, which pretty much goes literally everywhere. Two, I really like the Carlton area. So um, it's just a suburb away from Melbourne C CBD, but um, Carlton area is unique on their own. So it's more of like the buildings are different. I like to go to the park, go for my morning walk, then um, have a coffee like around the area and I just feel refreshed in the beginning of the day and three I really like socializing with my housemates in the building so whenever I go out to cook there's always um well not always but there's some there's someone out there and we just like to socialize and because we're all uni students we can talk about our uni life uni day-to-day -day activities four I think I would have to say we don't have to pay the bills here no electricity bill, no water bill, which is a really great plus plus. Yeah, so these are my greatest pros that I really like about Rooming Coast. But if I have to talk about the... Um, the only thing I don't like about Rooming Coast would be when I cook. I would have to um, go back and forth the kitchen and my room because even though we have like our cabinets where we can put our condiments, you know, plates, some of my pots are really big, like a big frying wok. So whenever I cook, I have to run back into my room, bring the wok, then come back to the kitchen. Yeah, but I don't really mind because regarding the amount that I have to pay and all these facilities, accommodations, all these friendly help, you know, community, I feel like rooming cost is really worth it. And I really don't think you can find any other place for this um, amount that you pay. And yeah, I'm really happy staying here. 